Caitlin, you just signed a new three-year deal. Talk us through how you're feeling. Oh, just, just honestly overwhelmed, um, elated, um, super proud to to put pen to paper for this club um, to secure a future, and it's it's a proud day for me, myself, and my family. As a lifelong Celtic fan, it must be a dream come true. Oh, just this this whole year has been a dream come true. Um, I didn't think it could get much better than the first year, obviously first year playing in the, the green and white, but it just keeps getting better and better. And especially now that the, the fans and women's football seems to be taking off, it's just something that I had to be a part of and I'm glad that I'm be a part of it for the future. Obviously it has been a fantastic season so far and your teammates have had a big part to play in that. How much gratitude do you owe to them for, for your Celtic career so far? Oh, everything, everything, if I'm honest, from them to my coaching staff. Um, they've just made me look good uh, a lot of the time and it's something I'm super thankful for but not just for them as players but for them as people they're good people and I just feel like there's always the the thing the initiative to be better and do better at this club and it's something I, I thrive under and I'm super excited for for the future. We've obviously got the final game of the league season here on Sunday how much yourself and the squad looking forward to that one? Oh of course I absolutely couldn't be looking forward to it more at Celtic Park with the with the Celtic fans. There's not really much you can dream of to be better. Um, but it's a big day, but we'll try not to play the occasion and try not to be overwhelmed by it. Um, we'll do the job at hand and hopefully reap the reward of the three points. Then we'll look up and see where we are at the end of the game and what will be will be.